Hello, this is Joe from Bombard Games, and I'm going to teach you how to play the weighted version of Spectrum. Um, it's quite simple. What we're going to do is assign values to each of the 12 colors, so as opposed to normal Spectrum, where each color is just worth one, if you want to think of it that way, and you just have to collect uh, X amount to win. In the weighted version, each color is going to have a value between three and seven, and as you capture the color, you're going to get the points uh, that color is worth and then the person with the most points at the end will win so it's an asymmetric version of spectrum really easy to play and set up we're going to take the weights missions and portals deck uh, and we'll do a video maybe how to keep your deck in order so you can do this quickly but these are already sorted here in TTS by primary and secondary so we're going to just take the first uh, card that comes up from each primary and each secondary and, and that's going to be the value of the color so for example yellow is going to be worth four uh, green is going to be worth five. We don't need another yellow, so let's kind of keep them over. Here. We'll put them in the center so we don't mess them up. Uh, blue is going to be worth six. Purple is going to be worth five. Red is going to be worth three. And now we just need to find ourselves an orange. Which... Okay. Hello. Orange. There he is. And we got a five for orange. So let's take these back, group them up. And we're just going to do the same exact thing for the secondaries. So blue, purple is going to be worth five. Orange, yellow is going to be worth seven. Purple, red is going to be worth, what was that, three? Blue, green is also going to be worth three. We're getting extras here. Blue, green again. Um, red, orange is going to be worth three, which means we're just looking for yellow, green. And there it is. So that's going to be worth three. Let's group these up. And now you won't need these cards anymore for uh, this version of Spectrum, so you could just toss them away. And now what you can do is uh, leave them on the edge of the board here if you'd like, or you can just put them in a pile somewhere and when a person or a player captures the color, they can take the card and then when you're done, you can just add up the value of your cards and you'll see who the winner is. So very simple to set up, but makes the game completely different because each color is worth different amounts. Some colors are worth twice as much as others. So for example, uh, orange yellow is worth more than twice as much as red, so there should be a bigger battle to capture it than red, but if you ignore red or you ignore too many of those low-value ones, you could find yourself uh, losing the game to somebody who got a few more colors that were worth less. So that's it. We'll see you in the next tutorial. Thanks for watching, and happy gaming.